Welcome to Collectors of the Coast. I'm Cash. And I'm Dash. Uh, and we are here to do a, we're going to open up a Innistrad Midnight Hunt bundle. Uh, kind of excited to see the die inside and what other uh, goodies uh, we pull. Uh, and uh, so to start though, we're going to do a clue for the guess the card. Ooh. I don't think anyone's got it yet at this point. Really? Uh, so I'm going to narrow it down. It is a creature. Uh, and, uh, what other clue am I going to give here? Uh, it's a creature and it's, oh, it's not the one. It's this one. All right. I had the cards all flip around here. So, uh, it is a creature and it, ca the casting cost is less than four. Okay. They like really narrow it down. Uh, put a guess, uh, what card it is in the comments below. If you guess the right card, you get the pack. All right, uh, good luck. We're going to flip it around. We're going to get into this bundle. I want to see uh, what kind of goodies are inside. Mm -hmm. The die is kind of, I wonder if it's going to be good or if it's going to be not good. We, we, it's hard to tell from the pack. So, mm -hmm. all right, uh, enjoy with us. All right, so we're going to get into this box. So I'll just remind people at home that if you do regularly watch the videos, do like the videos below. Um, it really does help us with the algorithm and everything, getting more viewers of the channel. And uh, we really like it. So this box is really cool. Actually, this is uh, this this fat pack box is beautiful. Uh, maybe the nicest one I've seen in quite some time. Yeah. Uh, got all the Halloween kind of theme. Got that crazy wolf. Uh, pretty nice. Highly recommend this box. Um, can it came with like a nice uh, moon, moon insert, which is kind of nice. Hmm. It kind of goes through the moon cycles. Yeah, yeah. So you got that day night thing. Your first harvest tide may be your last. Nights on Innistrad grow longer. The werewolves plan to ravage the humans' upcoming harvest tide festival to ensure the future of eternal night. Werewolf planeswalker Arlen Cord must stop her kin in encroaching darkness. Can she and her newfound allies restore balance before the sun sets for good? So pretty cool that that comes in there. Actually, the inside of this insert's got a bunch of information as well. You're probably really hard to see at home. I don't want to destroy this. Uh, it's got some like teeth and some different things. So can, can you wait? Can you wait? Yeah, thank you. All right. Uh, so just gonna mention, I got a recently. I got a, a Lorwyn fat pack. So this was a uh, this is really cool. Uh, item, uh, expensive, expensive item, uh, and uh, these Lorwyn boosters are worth quite a bit. Um, inside, uh, the difference, these ones now come with six uh, set boosters. Uh, back then, in this Lorwyn, you got this gigantic thing, and then you got you got a whole bunch of stuff inside. So you got, uh, back then, you used to get a player's guide, you get it a little, with a little encyclopedia, uh, card boxes, you get two card boxes in this one instead of the one. But the thing is, how do they fit Six booster, just listen, six booster packs... You get a bunch of basic lands, and some of the Lorwyn lands are actually that uh, the foil one land is worth like thirty dollars, uh, I think. Uh, and then you get the spin down life counter, and then yeah, it's a Pro Tour player card and a Lorwyn novel. So I don't know how, how to get the novel in there. The novel must be a little bit of a thinner novel or something. It's kind of kind of yeah. neat. Anyway, so like a bunch of cool stuff in there. Uh, anyways, we're gonna okay, get into this one. Yeah. So we had a little bit of a filming mishap, so we've kind of like Ooh, already wow, stood out with this them. die. Oh so, my god. It's amazing. Yeah. So anyway, so that we had a little bit of a, a miss up. So you'll see one of the packs is already open. So we had to start our refilming again. Um, yeah. But yeah, this this die is supposed mm -hmm. to glow in the dark. So we're gonna try to charge it up. We'll see if we, it's not really that dark out right now. So I don't know if we can get the glow in the dark uh, mode for you guys. Mm -hmm. But it is supposed to glow in the dark. It's actually pretty cool though, right? Yeah, it looks nice. We were afraid this is gonna be really faded and hard to read the numbers on, but they've actually done a real nice job. So. All right. So I what else is in here? The first pack. Well, what else is in here? So we got the Triscata file. Chris, I don't know if I say that right. Triscata file. Uh, pretty nice uh, promo card. And then we get the foil lands. Now, in this one, it's just basic foil lands. So this is the only spot I think in the set that we're getting these basic lands uh, like this. So I actually might be kind of collectible at the end because there's not maybe as many of them as some. So. You didn't. Okay, it doesn't matter. Just show the cards. Everyone knows at home we opened a pack already, man. He like doesn't want to like act like we're like haven't opened Badger, the pack or something. Astral Archmage, purifying dragon. This is all for us, anyways. Doesn't I matter. Know. All right, we got a, we got a planes. And this. Oh, and we got another rare. It's a double rare pack. Mm -hmm. Not a bad start. Why don't we go for pack for pack, okay? Okay. That sound good. All right, so uh, pack two. Uh, we'll mention. I don't know if I mentioned uh, there is only eight set boosters in these now. So mm -hmm. compared to uh, before, well, I mean before it was just draft boosters. I'd actually probably prefer to have the set boosters. So it's it's nice. Let's hope they got a second planes. Like ten and no, nah, they're probably not. I just gonna stick with the. Okay, they're they're going for a price, right? So when they when they print these things, they uh, they go for a price. So we got a bunch of uncommons. 
All right, harvest tide. Oh, 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 I see something at the back. I see something at the back. Graph that identity. Oh, my God. What is it? You control enchanted creature. And oh, my God. We got a foil to fairy. Yes. Mythic time. Oh, my God. Yesterday, we traded for one of those. Yeah, I made, like, the worst trade ever. I traded a regular uh, red and seven for a regular to fairy. But uh, we, oh we, love our, we love our patrons. That is amazing. So super excited. We got ourselves a Teferi. Oh my god. Happy to have that foil. You open it. You no, open you open. It. Pack you for pack. Open. You open it. You I open. insist. I insist. I don't care. You open. Fuck. Cards are going to be the same whether you open it or whether I open it. No, they're not. You know, it's just funny how he's like, you know, we know luck's not a real thing, but uh, it still feels like luck's a, real a thing. thing. <laughs> of course it is. You got a nice forest. Can I actually see the forest? There. So the forest. Huh. So this forest is the faded forest as well, right? Oh See how it's yeah. not the great. So this is like the collector packs. Is the white? I didn't. I didn't notice the other lands. Is the white the same? White's always the hardest to notice. Yeah, they're the bad lands. How? What the heck? All right. We got Storm the Festival. That is a rare that's holding quite a bit of value. Nice. Nice. Consider it and craft insect token. Oh, there you go. See, if I would open Wait, it, we would have pulled a three-three a... insect. It's a big insect, right? Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> all right, pull all right. Big, next pack. Pull big, pull big, pull we pull them, big, I think. We pull certainly big, we can't pull, pull them more than. Big, one. Pull. Nice. That, yeah, see, that's the that's different foil. land. That's foil. Yeah, but the land still—it's got the like the duller. Oh no. No, that's fine. It's the proper foil, I think. Oh, I'm gonna mm. have to compare this. I think it's the proper foil, actually. All right. Not bad. There's lots of flashback. In lots of there. lots of Halloweeny stuff in here, eh? And flashback. Jack o' lantern. Stuff. Taker. Cobbler. Tireless Haunter. All right, this isn't going to be as big, a big one. All right. Wardens. And? Ooh, Shipwreck Ooh. Marsh. Happy to have that. <gasps> oh, Harold's Horn. Oh, my God. This was like 20 oh. bucks. Oh, and another in a foil uh, Catilda. We've been pulling a lot of this one, so it doesn't feel that but big But it's thing. still a foil. Still nice to get a foil alternate art rare. Yeah. Uh, but that Harold Sorn, really nice list card in here. Harold Sorn is, is amazing. So we are on free money now. I think, I think on the, just judging by the, like, the cost of these cards and stuff, we're probably got about our box value already. At least. Faded. That is definitely faded. Yeah, and they don't have the, it's not the bright, it's the flat art. Grizzly ghoul. I'm a little disappointed by that. So the set boosters have the nicest lands. That's weird. I wonder if that's cool, going right? to affect the lands in the in the. the nice. I love that art. Yeah, it's so creepy. It's hilarious. So I uh, wonder if it's going to be like what? certain lands are going to be. Yeah. I wonder if the certain lands are going to be uh, worth a lot more because there's only so many of them that are printed well, and the rest are garbage. So, all right. So we got a Renin seven. Could we get a Renin seven in this box? What do you think? Oh my god. All right. So we get that would be crazy. I'm just like I'm. I'm kind of just disgusted by Wizards of the Coast on the print quality on the on the lands. Like it's yeah. it's it is kind of the best part about this set is those cool lands. Mm -hmm. Um, and to to kind of let it go, Denix. All right. I played a person who that was their commander in Brawl. Oh, nice. This decayed zombie is actually really. It's used with a lot of different cards, like. A yeah, lot. Yeah, Denik's cheap, so he's not bad for a commander that way. But and that, it's also uh, that. Yeah, well, and that screw ability, that, that, that is, uh, stopping that graveyard stuff is uh, is pretty good, so. Yeah. Anyway. Hey, this is definitely very faint. Oh, yeah, it's a, it's just a light purple. It's, they're not as nice. I thought given that they were set boosters that right I was going to get nicer ones, but it seems like they just, like, they're all over the place. All right, what do you got Fateful there? Full absence. Okay, what is that? Oh, that's that. Oh, that's, that's actually a good card. Yeah. Oh, and patron of the moon. Okay, it's not a big. It's not too expensive, but it is a pretty nice card. Moon pillow. Reprint from Kemigawa. Put the top two land cards from your hand into play tap. But I mean, by the time you have seven land, do you, how much? How often do you have land in your hand to put in? It's. But you it could works just with sacrifice a uh, merfolk, actually. Two, and then pay the rest. So it works with like the land triggers when you can bring stuff back to your hand and then play the, the lands again. Mm -hmm. All right, so we got, we did get the, what we got a it? faded island. Oh my god, that's a faded island. And then we island. got a candle grove witch, which is not a big card, but we got the but art signed. signed, which is kind of nice always. 
makes it worth maybe 50 cents versus a dollar. Right, this lands, this lands like so terrible compared to mm -hmm. like the, the other ones. All right. The, the other ones have, so the whole thing is not glossy. The other one, the whole card is like got a, a glossy front. These aren't even going to last as well. The printing quality is, is terrible. It feels like yeah. really wonky. The blue and black are the most, are the easiest to see. Yeah, it's that obvious. All right. Dreadhound. Uh, rebirth. Oh, double here. Just a common. All right, come on, come on. Something big? Ooh, Ooh! double mythic box. One's like... And this is a really yes. nice. Lear, Disciple of the Drown. This is a nice card. All right, and candle a candle trap. trap. So that was a pretty... That was a and hot a box. And a bat token. Cool. And a bat token. So this was a hot box. So we got some big cards. Just leave... Here. Teferi's amazing. We got the Teferi. We got Lear. We also got a couple of great... I mean, we got some other good rares, but we also like got... The, our Horn. list cards were really nice. So we got a couple of really nice list cards. For only eight packs, yes. we didn't hit any commons or anything. We hit like a rare and... Or two rare... Uh, it's just an uncommon, I guess. Basically a rare. Yeah, we hit a couple of really good uh, cards, so... And we also hit a land... Right, and we also got one of the lands, which is nice. So, all right. Well, I hope everyone did enjoy the video. We certainly did. Happy to have oh, that yeah. foil to ferry. So oh we got all God, the planeswalkers. So we're happy about that. Uh, I hope everyone enjoyed the video. Everyone have a magical day. Bye.